giant BOAC Stratocruiser Canopus waits to fly Princess Margaret to the West Indies. The Queen, Prince Philip and the Queen Mother are at London Airport to say farewell. The airport commandant, Sir John Dolbiak, escorts Her Majesty to the aircraft. The Queen, who wears a mink coat and crimson velvet hat, has journeyed in Canopus many times. It was in this plane that she flew the first part of her journey around the Commonwealth. BOAC Chairman Sir Miles Thomas and the Minister of Civil Aviation, Mr Boyd Carpenter, accompany the Princess and her mother. Her Majesty enters Canopus for a look at the cabin which has been specially furnished for Princess Margaret. Her Royal Highness has chosen an olive green velvet coat trimmed with mink and a small close-fitting feathered hat for the start of her 5,000 mile flight. Canopus flies the royal standard while the Queen is on board, but this is replaced by the Princess's own standard for the flight. The Princess, who will be away for about a month, blows a kiss to her family. Weather conditions are route her forced a last-minute change in the flight plan. However, Canopus will arrive in Trinidad at the original scheduled time. Canopus gathers speed as it moves down the runway, soon to set course for the blue skies of the Caribbean. With Princess Margaret go the best wishes of the nation and her family. A very happy tour in the sunshine of the West Indies.